Welcome to episode 20 of Gold Story. My name is Antasitor, and we're here outside of uh, Lorraine's office because she's set to see her. So here we are. Let's see what mistakes we made by signing a contract without reading it. I heard the video came together nicely. We may just have something with you. We want you to carry this. Pro Woods, thank you. Wow. Be sure to say, sign. It's praises frequently. Sing or sign? No, sing. Sing is praises frequently. Okay, thank you, Lorraine. Wait. Ah, uh, so that was it? Yeah. Alright, so let's go do um, some side questing in Tidy Park. Alright, let's see. I don't want to start with you. Let me get, like, a feel for the course before, for this, like, park before I do that one. If you get some vintage irons, I'll teach you how to lay them. Oh, I don't have vintage irons yet. Would you like me to teach you how to play this all? Yes, please, sir. The hazards on this course will be the end of you. I only want you playing from the fairways on this all. To help, let's have you do the whole thing with the, your wedge. You won't be able to hit as far, so you shouldn't get in any trouble. All right. So, I only have to stay in the fairway, right? Boom. Ooh. Okay. Mm. Sure, I'll make it. Ooh. gonna have to go here. What is this? That's not water, is it? Ooh. 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 Huh. What? Oh. Mm, I sh actually shouldn't risk it. <laughs> should probably go he mm, here even. Oh no! Ah, I messed up. Dang it! Ah, all right, let's try that again. Sorry, sir, I messed up the first time. I'll do it right this time. I promise. Promise you. All right, I'm back here with the final shot. Hopefully, this time I'm gonna get it. Not me not mess up. I can get this one. Woo! Success! That took longer than necessary, but... Mm -mm. You played the old smart. I'd implore you to play the same way on the course. Don't be tempted by low scores. Alright. Thank you, sir. Woo! Okay, you're done. <laughs> so these are puddles, but... There's nothing when I walk on them, just when the balls uh, drop on the uh, on the water, on the puddle. Um, no, not you. <laughs> there was someone here, was it? Nope, I guess not. Oh, we can go here? It's too long for a walk for, to the first hole. Okay, then we're gonna go up here. There we go. Golf courses are out of control these days. Back in my day, we had one set of trees for all players. And if you wanted a hole to be harder, you used your putter. Come, give it a go. Sure. Wait, only with the putter? Mm. I remember this. It didn't really matter. <laughs> Boom. I wonder if I'll even freaking make it. I 
Definitely gotta go full power. Well, I got into the place, right? Oh no, come on, he has to go in? Not so easy now, is it? Let me try that again. Alright, here I am again. Full power. <laughs> what? Alright, this time I'm in the rough, so it definitely has to go in. There we go. Freaking finally. Success! See? What is that more fun than slugging a driver 300 yards? Not really, sir. That was, uh, slow. <laughs> Alright. Ha, huh, this guy. Puddles are serious concern on this course. I see you have a rotting iron. That must mean you're ready to take the water on. Sure. The rotting iron can be a scoring club, if used correctly. I want you to gain some versatility with it. Let's see what kind of coverage you can get out of the water. Oh, oh, that thing! Well, I'm gonna impress you right now because I'm gonna chip it in. That's like my speciality, you know? That's what I'm known for. That's what I'm known for. Alright, maybe I should just go here. Okay, that's just one. Yeah, I mean, if I do both of this... Uh, well, no. This one. Wait, oh, this is my final hit? Oh, never mind, I'm, I'm not gonna be able to do it, so let's just mess it up. I've been failing all these quests that I have to do again. Alright, alright, I mean, they're kinda tough. Yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. Okay, let's try this again. Are you kidding me? You gotta stop thinking about it and just go for it. See? not. Nice. Okay, one more. One more in there. And that's it. Boom. Oh! Can I even get this? Yeah. Out with the wind, though, it might go further. Yeah, whatever. We got it, so it doesn't matter. Success! Oh, I forgot his vote. Not, n not many people can be effective with that club. Well done. <laughs> that wasn't it. Uh, yeah, give me more power. Give me more this. Give me this. Give me this. Give me this. Where do I get the vintage whatever thingy that he was talking about? Is there another area here? No. I guess we did everything then except for this guy over here. If you get some vintage irons, I'll teach you how to use them. Oh, this guy. 
Would you like me to teach you how to use your potting iron? Yes, please, but where are the greens? They're right here. We don't have any fancy flat grass, but this stuff gets the job done. The trick is to hit a little harder than you nor might normally do. Chipping becomes necessary close, sir, to the hole. Then on the green, you are used to as well. Why don't you try some pots to get a feel for it? You'll need to use a mixture of potting and chipping. Remember to hold CL or CR for approach shots. All right. I'm an expert at this, so let me show you my real power, uh, sir. Ho ho! Got it though. Boom. See, sir, I'm an expert at this. These are my favorite kind of shots. Ugh. Ugh. Still have four hits left. Yeah. Okay, okay, don't mess up. Okay, we're gonna get it right now. We're gonna get it right now. <laughs> I don't wanna. No, 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 no. Actually, this one should be fine. Boom. There we go. Now, these are just practice. Well, it's just one. Oh, got it, anyways. Success. Good roll. Play these screens enough and you won't be able to go back. Alright. Yeah, well, that's basically how I play now. What's happening here? A tidy six is better than a messy four. Many youngsters sign just can't keep up when they come to our curse. Curse, of course. Alright. Is there any spare change in here? What happens if I hit this car? Young man! I don't know what the rules are at your local course, but there will be absolutely none of that at our course. Did I get kicked out? <laughs> I got kicked out. <laughs> Sorry, sir, I didn't mean to. Oh, I guess we can do this one. Now that we got a feel for the course. This course is old, so it was difficult to work with. But I think I've managed to Mother Nines it well enough. You will, however, need some old clubs to play it. Oh. Wait, so right now what do I have? I have... The well-worn... No, the vintage woods. Okay. I'm missing the irons. Puddle Wedge, that's gotta be the vintage one, right? And, well, I don't have a... Okay, well, let's go talk to... Oh! Oh! Oh, no, yeah, 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 this guy over here. Come see me when you're eligible to join... Oh, never mind. Sorry, members only in the clubhouse. Return to the closer when you have a gentleman, caddy, one of one, etiquette, lesson three of three, old clubs, two of four. <sighs> Oh, wait, so where should I go for all clubs then? Oh man, did they tell me and I forgot? I always imagined this course being a lot nicer. I'm so ready to see the inside of this clubhouse. This course is just a stepping stone to the pro tour for me. Mm. Oh, I never went in here. Duh. Disc. That's a set of lawn balls. Yep, it can be a pretty interesting game. Used to play in a team with a few of the boys actually. Gave it up eventually. My schedule was too busy with the shop and I just didn't take to it like the other blokes. We had fun though. 
Every weekend we'd add down to our local and bowl a round of half of each. Any more than that extra half round and we'd have to pay for two rounds, so it was always a round and a half. Almost played two once, but young Alfred, or he was back then, young Alfred had a newborn and he couldn't justify the extra cost. He felt so bad. Let each of the boys roll on of his shots in his final half round. It stays like those I'll always remember. But listen to us, getting carried away, aren't we? We yeah, are a little bit, sir. Are you interested in buying those? Long balls, 156, have so much money. Yeah. That's Tom's old butter. Puts like an absolute dream. Puts straight as an arrow. I saw him make a lot of birdies with it over the years. Of course, Tom always has was best at putting. Did his bag in last month, so he's upgraded to a newer, more forgiving butter. Of course, his new butter doesn't comply with course regulations, so he had to cancel his membership. Poor thing was distraught. Many said he just he should just stick with the old butter, but he was certain that it was the club that did his bag in. In the end, he just handed me the club, didn't try to get a penny for it. But Tom always was stubborn like that, and long-winded. If he got caught you, he could take your ear off for hours, and often about the most trivial things, didn't matter how busy you were. So anyway, did you want to buy it? Yes, sir, because I don't want to go through that again. <laughs> oh, man. That's a lovely set of irons. You won't find any like it. That's because they're handmade by a local blacksmith. He can be a little excitable, always coming up with strange new well ways to forge his clubs. He gets right into the scientific part of golf. Luckily, he's able to stick to tradition when making our clubs. No distant improving medals, no oversized hats. Of course, they are blades. But then, back in your day, back in our day, all clubs were blades. You might find those a little harder to hit, but that's the way we like it. When you reach the level that our members are at, the easy stuff doesn't cut, cut it for you. I believe the set of irons belong to the club owner at, the, at one point. Played a few rounds with them and declared them defective. But that's how it can be with handmade clubs. Are you interested in them or did you just come here to chat? I, um, I have one. Whoa! I want them, sir. Thank you, bye. <laughs> oh man, that was... That was torture. Well, I, le I guess we... What about this? Oh, 15 yards. Nice. But we gotta equip all the vintage. Do we, though? Let's go talk to this guy first. Do that mission. I see you've got some vintage irons. You can't afford to go all gung-ho with clubs like that. Want to try playing it safe? Yes, sir. I want you to practice hitting the fairways. It might be tempting to hit further, but don't be a hero. The hazards here will cause you serious trouble if you find them. All right, sir. I'll follow your advice. Hmm. I think I just messed it up. Or not. Actually, that was better. I would have messed it up. Had I gone stronger than that, okay. I'm gonna go here then. Oof. Oof. <sighs> oh! Oh, I still have a, a few hits left. Okay. I thought that was it. Ugh. Okay, I can't miss anything now. Yep, gotta restart. Too bad, has heard. You didn't play safe enough. All right, here we go again. Boom. Ooh. Still going to the edge. So I might want to go like here. Ah, oh, come on. No, that's too much. Ooh, 
got it thanks to the tree. Stop, 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 stop. Ooh, okay, we got it. Blech. Nah, it's fine, we got it. Success! There's a good lad. Never hit further than you can throw a stone. This rule was, has served me well for many years. Thank you, sir. Oh, okay. That means we can finally play this thing, then. You need some old clubs to play the course. It simply cannot hold up to modern equipment. Right, let's see, I guess I had to equip it. Vintage woods, vintage irons, puddle wedge, and antique putter. Heavy and inaccurate. <laughs> Great. You need some old clubs to play the course. It simply cannot hold up to modern equipment. What? I do have... Is it because of the puddle wedge? But... Isn't this vintage? Isn't this vintage? Alright, well, let's see if we can... I have returned as a gentleman. Okay, I'll run this into the owner. Okay, it's not official yet, but you're welcome to enter the clubhouse as you please. Thank you. Wait, time to go to the coach? Time to find coach in Tidy Park Clubhouse, okay. But I want to see if I can play this now. Oh, there we go. Yeah, let's do it. I call this one Tidy Pars at Tidy Park. Oof, okay. Okay, nope. Nope. So around here should be... Nope, nope. In the clubhouse. Oh wow. Wait, where am I? Okay. So definitely want to go here. Ugh. What? How is that a puddle? That's clearly in the freaking. This one we know. Oh no, but I'm using the. Oh, I can use this. Okay, never mind. Oh, thank you. There's only so much I can do with this course. Is he holding a newspaper or a map? <laughs> Fine. This is what we've been practicing for. Come on. Come on. Just, just there. Ugh. All right, worked out. Bit of a sad situation, this. So far away, next to that guy. Okay, let me see. I think it's better to go here because of the trees. Oh. <laughs> nope! <sighs> the 
trees were in heaven it. Oh wow! I didn't realize I wasn't using the putter. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh my! I call this one the Pathfinder. Oh! So if I hit the car, am I like done? Follow the path. Just to be safe. Alright. Gotta show that guy that I can do this. Success! That was impressive! The course is quite old, but I did the best I could. I'm proud of what I've created here, but I was made for greater things than this. So I'm off to seek greener pastures, or perhaps bluer pastures? That's right, I'm headed for the greatest course of all. I've got some great ideas for that place. Is it the... Um, snowy one? That's not blue, it's white. Level up! Alright, got my accuracy right. So, uh, I guess this. I won't need that much power on this course, so I'll go for this, and this, whatever that is, and this again. <laughs> All right. Can I get stuff here? Yeah. Give me all that spare change. Can we play here? Wait, what was the thing that we bought? Yeah. Have a roll. Long balls. Alright, well, that's gonna do it for this episode, though. So, it was a rough start doing those um, side quests, but uh, I think I redeemed myself a little bit on that, uh, trying the course for that guy. Uh, so, anyways, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like the video if you like it, and do subscribe for more. Thanks again.